Hello Harvard 6, welcome to EIE Video English. We will start Senior Plus Book 1 today. Please open to page 6. Before we get started, let's begin with some warm-up questions. Let's discuss the questions below. Do you like traveling? Which countries or cities have you been to? Which country or city was your favorite? Which country or city was your least favorite? Please think about these questions and on Friday we will discuss them together. Now let's go to page 6 together. Please think about what kind of trip you would like to take. There are many different kinds of trips. Let's discuss some examples. You can take a safari to see wildlife in Africa. You can visit a ski resort in Canada. You can get a package tour guide trip to England. Or you can take a Mediterranean cruise around Italy. What kind of trip do you want to take? Let's listen to the writer's trip to America. As you listen, please circle the words that you hear below. My trip to America. Many people have different opinions on what they want to do for their vacation. There are people who want to relax at a beach, visit busy cities, or go on a cruise. I have been on various types of vacations. However, my trip to America was the most memorable. This is because I did so much with my family. First in New York, we got to see all the soaring skyscrapers. They look much bigger and wider than anything I have ever seen in Seoul. Then, we went to Six Flags in New Jersey. There we rode all the thrilling roller coasters one could ride. Next, we flew over to Washington, D.C. We went to the most famous museum, the National Gallery of Arts. After that, we saw the stunning White House. That is where the president lives. Next, we went to Florida. We went to well-known attractions and ate at fabulous restaurants. Then we took a cruise around the Caribbean for four nights and five days. On the cruise, everything was all you can eat. There were so many selections of food to choose from. It was too tough to choose between all of them. Since I have arrived back in Seoul, I feel a bit sad because my long journey came to an end. However, I must say that was the most pleasant and delightful trip I have ever taken. Let's check which words you found. Did you find opinions? Did you find memorable? Did you find gallery? Did you find fabulous? Did you find relax? Did you find sour? There is no sour. Did you find magnet? There is no magnet. Did you find Selections. Did you find bus? There is no bus. Did you find skyscrapers? Did you find well known? Did you find cold? There is no cold. Did you find various? Did you find Thrilling? Did you find attractions? Did you find pleasant? 
Very good job. On page seven, let's listen to the essay one more time and then answer a few questions together. My trip to America. Many people have different opinions on what they want to do for their vacation. There are people who want to relax at a beach, visit busy cities, or go on a cruise. I have been on various types of vacations. However, my trip to America was the most memorable. This is because I did so much with my family. First in New York, we got to see all the soaring skyscrapers. They look much bigger and wider than anything I have ever seen in Seoul. Then, we went to Six Flags in New Jersey. There we rode all the thrilling roller coasters one could ride. Next, we flew over to Washington, D.C. We went to the most famous museum, the National Gallery of Arts. After that, we saw the stunning White House. That is where the president lives. Next, we went to Florida. We went to well-known attractions and ate at fabulous restaurants. Then we took a cruise around the Caribbean for four nights and five days. On the cruise, everything was all you can eat. There were so many selections of food to choose from. It was too tough to choose between all of them. Since I have arrived back in Seoul, I feel a bit sad because my long journey came to an end. However, I must say that was the most pleasant and delightful trip I have ever taken. After you have listened to the essay again, please think about these questions. Why does the writer feel sad? What made him become sad? What memorable travel experiences do you have? Please think about a vacation or travel that you went on recently. And what do you want to experience on your next trip? Think about these questions and we will talk about them on Friday. Let's begin page eight. Listen to the comprehension questions and circle true or false on your paper. Then we will check together. Number one, the writer went to New York first. Number two, the writer did not ride roller coasters on his trip. The writer did not see the president's house. The writer went to many museums. The food at the restaurants was terrible. The beaches he went to in Florida were famous. The writer stayed on the cruise for four nights and five days. There were many things to do on the cruise. Please check your answers. Now let's check together. Number one, the writer went to New York first. This is true. Number two, the writer did not ride roller coasters on his trip. This is false. He did ride roller coasters on his trip. Number three, the writer did not see the president's house. This is also false. He did see the president's house.
Number four, the writer went to many museums. This is false. He did not go to many museums. Number five. The food at the restaurants was terrible. This is also false. The food at the restaurants was not terrible. Number six. The beaches he went to in Florida were famous. This is true. Number seven, the writer stayed on the cruise for four nights and five days. This is also true. Number eight, there were not many things to do on the cruise. This is false. There were many things to do on the cruise. Next, let's answer the multiple choice questions. First, I will read all four questions. Please mark your answers. After I read all four questions, we will check the answers together. Number one, what is not true? The writer went to many places. The writer ate a lot of good food. The writer did not go on a cruise. And the writer went to a museum. Which one is not true? Number two, what is true? The writer went to America. The writer hated his trip. The writer went to London. Or the writer went to France. Which one is true? Number three, what is the topic of the passage? The writer went on a memorable trip to America. The writer went to Europe. The writer had a lot of fun on a cruise. Or the writer had a lot of fun. Which one is the topic of this passage? And number four. Why did he feel depressed? The writer's trip was terrible. The writer did not eat good food. The writer's memorable trip came to an end. Or the writer did not like the cruise. Which one made him feel depressed? Please check your answers. Now we will check together. Number one. Which is not true? It is C. The writer did not go on a cruise. This is not true. He did go on a cruise. Number two. Which one is true? It is A. The writer went to America. This is true. Number three, what is the topic of the passage? It is also A. The writer went on a memorable trip to America. And number four, why did he feel depressed? It is C. The writer's memorable trip came to an end. Now, let's go to page 9. Please read the story one more time and find out which cities the writer visited first, second, third, fourth, and fifth. Then, write the number next to the city. 
New York, Washington, D.C., New Jersey, Florida, and the Caribbean. After you have found which cities he visited in which order, we will check together. Which city did the writer visit first? Did you write New York? That's correct. He visited New York first. Which city did he visit after New York? Did you write New Jersey? That's correct. He visited New Jersey second. Which city did he visit after New Jersey? Did you write Washington, D.C.? That is correct. He visited Washington, D.C. third. Which city did he visit after Washington, D.C.? Did you write Florida? That is correct. He visited the city of Miami in Florida fourth. Where did he visit after Florida? Did you write the Caribbean? That's correct. He visited the Caribbean fifth. You did a great job today. I look forward to our next lesson on Wednesday. Homework for this class is to finish writing on page 9. Please write in complete sentences. Write down the places he visited in order. We will check this together on Friday. After you finish page 9, please finish workbook page 4 and practice book pages 4 and 5. I will see you Wednesday.